that was a slog of a hike in, oh my god. That was not easy. It's going down to negative 20. Feels like negative 30 tonight. Out here where I am is quite exposed, except for the fact that the wind's coming from my back, if there's any. <laughs> Got all my cutlery. Hot chocolate at negative 20 is the best. Out of all three utensils, a spoon is definitely the least effective for eating sausages. Yeah, 100%. Two boots. I slept like a baby angel last night. 
I got smoked out hard though at one point. All the smoke from the fire was just billowing in here and just recirculating. I was choking to death. That was like really crappy. Feels good to get through that night because it was particularly cold. I might not even set up a tarp tonight. Some animal left their imprintation from probably sleeping there a couple of nights ago, last night, I don't know. Can't tell anymore, but there was a big impression right here with tracks leading to it and from it. My guess it was a moose slept here, which means that this area is probably pretty protected from the wind. So I'm gonna camp right there, 15 feet from this spot. And I'm gonna hope that no moose comes by, or I mean, he can come back and just be neighbors neighbors and chill it's not it's not the rut so it won't come and pummel me or try to you know get me
woke up at 2. It was snowing and the fire was completely kaput. Getting snowfall on your face while you're sleeping is like a PG version of being waterboarded. Just like, ooh, cold, ooh, cold, ooh, cold. Pack up was a cinch. All I had to do was roll up my sleeping mat and my tarp, and it took all of five minutes. And I'm basically ready to head out. That was an awesome trip. That was a very, very awesome trip. Just because I'm very comfy right now doesn't mean I can think that this whole trip was a cakewalk. The snowshoeing was real tough. The first night was absolutely freezing. The second day I was so tired and I was dragging my feet. It was not an easy adventure. It was tough. And I think that this moment right now and the comfort and the serenity I'm sitting in is due to the fact that I went through all that, that difficulty, really accentuates this moment and this experience. Feeling pretty good right now. Thank you God for this beautiful day, all this beautiful food I've eaten over this trip, all the wonderful fires I could create, the great amounts of sleep I had, and just such, thank you for this beautiful, beautiful experience. It's been a real treat.